RSL Insider presented by at and I'm your host, Brian Dunseth. Real Salt Lake back in training here at Zango Field for their final session before hopping a charter tomorrow afternoon for direct flight to San Jose, Costa Rica in preparation of Tuesday night's CONCACAF Champions League quarterfinal matchup, Leg 2. And with a week of training session underneath their belt following the emphatic 4-1 win over the LA Galaxy seven days ago, head coach Jason Kreitz and Real Salt Lake wasting no time getting back to work, knowing that a 2-0 aggregate lead might not be enough at Estadio Ricardo Saprissa. We're just going to have to, you know, weather the storm, I think, is uh, going to be a big part of it because they're, the energy from their fans and um, being a bit desperate to, to uh, nail down is... It's definitely going to be a, you know, a lot of energy right out of the gate. So if we can match that or even beat that energy, um, then you know we'll be on our way. We know what Saprisa has. We we played them before, but we know it's also going to be a different environment. So we've been training and, and trying to be in those kind of environments of, of being down a goal or being up a goal, holding a lead, and, and that's something we need to do. And we've do, been doing the you know this whole year. So uh, I think uh, the attitude's good and, and the focus is good. We just got to go out there and, and um, you know get a point similar to an MLS playoff in the first round. Um, it's a little different than the MLS Cup Final or the MLS uh, Semi-Final, the Conference Final, because those are one-off games. Um, these are, these are uh, home and away series. It's going to be a great atmosphere. I think it's an experience that we're all looking forward to. Um, it'll be difficult, but um, those challenges are, you know, they're fun. So we're, we're looking forward to it. And, um, you know, hopefully we can go down there and, and really uh, do what we want to do. I think they can expect uh, an atmosphere that's very similar to ours right now in our stadium. Um, it's a it's a group that gets there and, and, and really wills their team on to, to impressive results and wills their team on to um, passionate, emotional beginnings of matches. It's kind of a it's an interesting lead to have. You know, it's they say it's the uh, it's the most dangerous lead to have. It's two zero because you give one up and now the other team gets some momentum. It's a two goal goal. So uh, if we could get a goal or or uh, you know not give up any. Um, that's what we're shooting for. We've got to approach the game with the right mentality. I think it would be foolish of us to, to approach it as if we have a two-goal lead. I think we need to get ourselves in the mindset that we're going down there to get a result, and a result for me away in a place like that is a draw or a win. We're just a confident team right now. We, we know what we could do. We know what we could accomplish, and, and uh, we're playing to those standards right now. Obviously, uh, we want to peak at the right time, but uh, it's okay to, you know, to have this form right now, especially in this tournament. Uh, we're maturing on the road. We're, um, we're we're becoming really tough to beat, and um, it's just it's been fun. It's been a lot of fun. We go into games thinking we're going to win this game, and if uh, if not, then we're going to get a draw, and that's our mentality. I think that our, our early season form has a lot to do with the, the responsibility that the players took upon themselves to work very hard in the preseason. I mean, in the off season, um, to to get themselves to a level of fitness where we could start right away in on soccer. I think as we move forward every single year we get a little bit better uh, at what we're asking the players to do. We've already made history as far as farthest an MLS team has gone this far in this tournament. Can you guys taste uh, you know, the ultimate prize? Of oh, this? No, no, no. We still have a lot left. Um, you know, we have basically the second half of this game coming up and you know, nothing's given. You know, you know, it's going to be all of it. I'm going to first goal, um, and uh, yeah, still, still off the battle to play either one of those Mexican teams. Right up there with the MLS Cup, so we're going to be putting everything we got into it.